Uh, I was uh, 21. I was 20 years old. I was in college, and I met a really pretty young woman. Day, and then I was like, uh, I haven't had my period. Um, I, I took a test. I'm pregnant. I was 50 grand in debt. Marry her. My dad told me. He said. He said, whatever you do, don't get married. And she had been raped once or twice in her life. I'm, uh, I'm biracial. My mother is a white Midwestern woman. My father's from Kenya. We lived together for like nine months, so through about half of her pregnancy and four months after the child was born, and then I decided to bail. <sighs> so then I just sort of stopped seeing him as much. It started going from like three weeks to three months to a year. And are you still on the hook for the child support? No, actually, uh, she asked me if her husband, if, if I could sign adoption papers so that he would legally become her husband's. So you have a kid with the white girl, and the white guy ends up adopting your kid. Yeah. All right. The, the new girlfriend. She knows all of this history, right? Yes. She is very good when it comes to like disciplining her kids. Like she doesn't yell at them. She doesn't hit them. She's very caring and emotional and she wants to listen to them. Uh, who takes care of her kids when she's working? During the day, her husband, legal husband, who lives with her, is watching the six month old. Is he a white guy? Yeah. Okay. She adopted a baby girl after she separated from her husband who's still living there. Right. And Why did she want a baby? She has a boyfriend, which would be you. The first child is not adopted, right? No, and that child was not by her legal husband either. Oh, seriously, man. All right. Right. After, after she was separated from her legal husband, she met a man. They were at a bar, and she ended up sleeping with him that night. She doesn't recall it. She doesn't know. It's, I don't know if she was too drunk or if she was drugged. This man had just gotten out of prison a week before, and she didn't know Oh, no, that. no, no. He's Asian. Um, like Chinese or? Like Vietnamese, like half Vietnamese and half white, I think. Oh, he would, he treated her bad. He had like six or seven other children with other women already, but she ended up leaving him and uh, moving back in with her uh, separated husband. The separated husband is the one that ended up signing the legal papers for uh, this child that was born out of wedlock with the other guy. So if I understand, Whitey McCuckison is spending his days tending to the daughter of the ex-prison convict who drunk fucked his wife, and now he is raising her. That's right. Dude, are you kidding me? What the fuck are you doing?